You want to get some birdies in the morning? Yeah? You want to get the birdies in the morning? Oh, oh, oh. Okay, okay. We gotta set an alarm. Four hours and 56 minutes. We can do it. I need some water. What is up YouTube ladies and gents? We are gonna go pheasant hunt and I'm gonna call this the hangover hunt. Was, I had a little rough night last night and uh, yeah, my head hurts a little bit. But it is 5.30 in the morning and uh, me and the Biggie Bear are gonna go do this. I was out late last night with uh, one of my best friends and my old chef. It was kinda like his going away party with the company. So I had a few drinks, stayed out a lot later than I did. I tried to get an awesome video of us all cheersing, but I just got this stupid picture. So that on top of working a crazy weekend with uh, with little sleep to begin with, yeah, we're uh we're we're we went rolling in the Z's, but we're gonna roll in the birdies. You ready? I get down low. Yeah, he knows. He knows. He's like, you're gonna miss dad. We'll see you there. just realized is this is the first time I've filmed with you guys in the new whip. This is the first time. Not only that is we got to do a little off-roading to get where we're trying to go. So it is six o'clock in the morning. It is currently 20. Oh, it just dropped to 25 degrees outside that's Fahrenheit cold as hell and we gotta drive back this little trail it's probably not gonna be very exciting to watch right now because it's completely dark outside but it's gonna be fun and on the way back we'll get we'll get some some nice off-road clips when we leave today if all else fails so at least at least we won't be leaving here without any content at all so I hope you guys are going to enjoy this hungover morning with me. 25 degrees. I might be a little, might be a whiny little bitch. No, we're gonna make it happen. I just hope I don't miss. I don't know how fast my my draw speed's gonna be. Hey, ah, ah, ah. Byron, Byron, hey! Let's get him, bud. Let's get him. Oh. 
That's what happens when your dog's too excited. Miss that one. And I'm up. Dead bird. That was an awkward shot. Fuck. <laughs> That old ass active shell like threw sparks, man. <laughs> man, when they fly right over top of your head like that. Where'd he go? Hunt it up. There it is. been a slow start to the season for me that was an awkward flush right there I saw him and he just like he peeked in the wood line like I don't think they see me yet and then Byron got on him and he flew like out I was gonna let it like let him get out of the trees and come across the field before I took a shot but he came out and flew like straight up I can't wait to see the GoPro footage because I, I completely missed that first shot because I was just like swinging and but man, we got ourselves a beautiful bird. Beautiful bird. First ring neck. Excited dog. All right, so, whew, hung over hunting. Missed the first shot, but we got a bird in the vest. So let's get after the next one. All right, biggie boy. Come on, fly up this way, baby. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> Come on, Byron. <whistles> Man, I'm a horrible shot this morning. Too close to the ground. Oh! Fuck! God, damn, that was cool. Big. <laughs> that had to be the coolest slash worst flush I've had in a long time. I did not expect that rooster to come up. I mean, that first hen took off. She like she went so low with like the woods with the like the brush line she went so low with it i didn't want to shoot because i didn't want to like shoot towards the ground i didn't know where byron was in this and then as soon as i like kind of be like all right we'll get back to it that rooster right in front of me hey. honestly scared the crap out of me Man, that was cool. Super cool. But I'm going to take a little breather. Take a little breather. We're going to hit this next set of fields because the birds are here. The birds are out today. So this is going to be great. Um, I'm going to kind of collect. I need to collect myself and stop wasting ammo. Okay. We're just around the bend from the second set of fields. 
Sun's up, guns up. Where'd he go? Battery change, right when he's on set. <clears throat> Alrighty, so we are back where we saw the very first rooster today. We had all that action within an hour. And then we haven't put up a bird since. So we're gonna go down over this hillside where there's always a, usually a few birds. So I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna take my hungover ass up and down this big ass hill to try to get one more bird in a bag. And then we'll head out of here. Barn, barn, heel. Up here. Good call, Dad. Hunt him up. Get you. Barry, come on. Good boy. Let's get him. Where'd he go? Easy. Iron. Okay. I don't know what spooked him up there. But, uh, yeah, they're up in here somewhere. So we chased him from here, down here, back up to here. We're gonna get, we're gonna get this guy eventually. It's making my, uh, hungover ass work for it. I'm sweating it out. Where all that go down? Huh. 
There you go. Hunt them up. Where are you going? Did he get him? Hell yeah, he got him. Woo! Wow, so that long ass shot I took, I hit him. It downed him. Downed him enough for but I can get through this valley. Hold on, safety. All right. Yeah, I think he got him. Where'd you go? Here he is. <laughs> get him, Byron, get him. Get him, Byron. Yeah. Good boy. Good boy. Yes. Okay. Yes. Yes. You're the man. You're the man. Oh man. What a way to conclude the hangover hunt. I can't believe that I took that long shot when he reflushed him from the bottom. And I knew it was going to be a long shot, so I hit my bottom barrel that has a slightly tighter choke in it. And I must have got it just enough, just enough that I caught him. And we pushed him back up the hill onto the left side of the trail. Heard him up there. Byron pushed him back across the trail. We came back through the woods, and he caught up with him and got him for me. Man, what a great day. Um... I don't even know what to think. That was awesome. I couldn't be more excited with how that turned out. So just pump, pump feeling. So glad I got my ass up this morning and got out here. And it's, man, just a, what a pleasure. What a pleasure. There's nothing, nothing beats fall pheasant hunting out with my little man here. So pumped. I'm going to leave you here. I got to find my shotgun. I don't know where I dropped it. I got to bag this bird. And then we got to hike up this huge hill to get back out of here. So I'm going to end it here for the actual video. I'll get some clips going off-road and then the Suzuki on the way out of here, though. And I'll tag those in the end. If you guys enjoyed it, make sure you hit that like button. Hit the subscribe button. And uh, drop me a line. Let me, think, let me know what you think about me missing. But uh, until next time, Huggy Bear. Peace. That is what I'm talking about, man. Yes. Cool. Man. Just awesome. Damn awesome. On the struggle bus today. Totally on the struggle bus. Today.